All right, so let's get started because I think this process is pretty darn cool. So the very first thing that I did is I took a photo of our son and I uploaded it to ChatGPT 4.0 and I said, hey, ChatGPT 4.0, can you recreate him into a Pixar character? And so ChatGPT did exactly that. Looks cool. And then I said, you know what, ChatGPT, he looks a little lonely. Can we give him a best friend? And so ChatGPT did that, gave him a best friend. We call him Flame. And I said, you know what, it would be really cool if we had different scenes of them just having fun together. And so ChatGPT 4.0 did that. It recreated all of these different scenes for us. And then I took those scenes and I put them into a tool called Runway, their generation four model. And for those that haven't tried it yet, it is so, so good. It gave me all of these animated videos. I then spliced them and put them together into one video in a video editing tool. And it looks like this. Now, I said, you know what? Let's do some fun things with our Vision Pro. We've got this amazing spatial computer. What can we do with it? So I took that video and I put it inside of my Vision Pro. First of all, it's really cool to blow up nice and big and look at it. it makes the image really come to life. But the next step was to take it into an app called Spatial Media Toolkit and spatialize that video, give it depth. And so it converted that into a spatial video and it's, it's really hard to see on this 2D image or this 2D video, but just know that putting them side by side the spatial video is 10 times cooler than the flat video, okay? But I didn't stop there. I said, you know what? ChatGPT 4.0 is so good about creating 3D looking characters. And so I went back to ChatGPT and I said, hey, can you turn these two characters into toys? And it did that and they looked really, really fun. And then I thought it'd be cool to look at them in augmented reality. I said, you know what, ChatGPT, can you give me these characters with the white backgrounds? And so it did that for both characters. And then I took those images and I uploaded them into a tool called Polycam. And then Polycam has this great new feature where ultimately you can upload an image and then it turns it into a 3D object. So I did that with both of our characters. I exported them. I sent them to my Vision Pro. And then I put my Vision Pro on and I pulled them up and I moved them around my office and they look so incredible. And then I showed this to my son and you should have seen the smile on his face to see that he had been recreated as a Pixar character, then a movie and then toys. I really do think that we live during the coolest era in human history. You can just create now, you can create movies, you can create 3D objects. With that, I hope you have a fantastic day and I'll see you on the next one.